So this lesson we're going to look at the different types of microscopes used in biology. Firstly, light microscopes. They obviously use light. They have a lower resolution than electron microscopes. They have a maximum resolution of about 0.2 micrometers. The maximum useful magnification of a light microscope is about 1500. Electron microscopes use electrons instead of light to form an image. They have a higher resolution than light microscopes so give more detailed images. There are two kinds of electron microscope, transmission electron microscope, TEM. Use electromagnets to focus a beam of electrons, which is then transmitted through the specimen. Denser parts of the specimen absorb more electrons, which makes them look darker on the image you end up with. TEMs are good because they provide higher resolution images, but they can only be used on thin specimens. Scanning Electron Microscope SEM. Scan a beam of electrons across the specimen. This knocks off electrons from the specimen, which are gathered in a cathode ray tube to form an image. The images produced show the surface of the specimen and can be 3D. But they give lower resolution images than TEMS. Magnification is how much bigger the image is than the specimen, the sample you're looking at. It's calculated using this formula. Magnification equals length of image over length of specimen. Resolution is how detailed the image is. More specifically, it's how well a microscope distinguishes between two points that are close together. If a microscope lens can't separate two objects, then increasing the magnification won't help. Light microscopes have a maximum resolution of 0.2 micrometers and a maximum resolution of 1500. Transmission electron microscopes have a maximum resolution of 0.0001 micrometers and a maximum resolution of more than 1 million. Scanning electron microscopes have a maximum resolution of 0.005 micrometers and a maximum resolution of less than 1 million. In light microscopes and TEMs, the beam of light, or electrons, passes through the object being viewed. An image is produced because some parts of the object absorb more light, or electrons, than others. Sometimes the object being viewed is completely transparent. This makes the whole thing look white because the light rays, or electrons, just pass straight through. For light microscopes, you use dye. Common stains are methylene blue and diosin. The stain is taken up by some parts of the object more than others, the contrast makes the different parts show up. For the electron microscope, Objects are dipped in a solution of heavy metals, like lead. The metal ions scatter the electrons, again creating contrast. 